Hi and welcome to the session. Today we will learn some constructions related to perpendiculars. Before moving on to the constructions, let's see what are perpendicular lines. Two lines, say L and M, are perpendicular to each other if the angles formed between them are right angles. So each angle is 90 degrees. So first of all, let us see the construction of perpendicular to a line through a point on it. So here we are given a line L and a point X on it. So we have a line L and a point X on it. Now with X as center and any radius draw an arc to cut line L at points A and B with X as center means Place the pointer of your compasses at point X and open your compasses with any radius and draw an arc to cut the line L at points A and B like this. So we got the points A and B. After this, open the compasses. More than AX. Now, with A and B as center, draw two arcs to cut each other. At point Y like this. Now join XY so XY is the required perpendicular to line L and we will write XY is perpendicular to line L this symbol is used to show perpendicular to. Now let's move on to the next construction that is perpendicular to a line through a point not on it. In this construction, we are given a line L and a point X not on it. So, we have a point X over here with X as center. And any radius draw an arc to cut line L at points A and B. 
like this. Now, with A and B as center and same radius, draw two arcs to cut each other. at point Y. So we got the point Y. Now join XY. So we got XY as the perpendicular to line L. That means XY is perpendicular to line L. So let's move on to our next construction that is the perpendicular bisector of a line segment. For this construction as our first step, draw a line segment AB of any length this one. Now, open compasses more than half of AB. Now, throughout the construction, keep the radius same, that is, more than half of AB and with A as center, draw two arcs on both sides of line segment AB. Next, with B as center, draw two arcs on both sides of line segment AB to cut previous arcs at points P and Q. Lastly, join PQ. Thus, PQ is the perpendicular bisector of line segment AB. So, in this session, we have learned to construct a perpendicular to a line through a point on it. Perpendicular to a line through a point not on it. And the perpendicular bisector of a line segment. With this, we finish this session. Hope you must have understood all the constructions. Goodbye, take care and have a nice day.